Astrotometry Log, it's October 27th, 2009, approximately 12.15 a.m. UTC. This is Sunspot 1029. It is growing, and according to astrotometry, this spot is the harbinger of a hypersymmetric sun grazing comet. This is the hypertime foreshadow of a comet that is approaching the sun. It has entered the Earth's space, it has entered the space between the Earth's orbit and the sun, and this is the hypertime interference as the Earth is being translated through time of that object that uh, that object creates on the primary time axis according to astrotometry. And so we should be seeing in the next few days a sun grazing comet and a fairly large one, from, judging from the size of this um, this uh, shadow, and also possibly more than one. It looks like it's breaking up. And if it breaks up completely before it arrives at the sun, it may not be visible. But if it remains intact, if it remains this, uh, this uh, intact, as time moves forward, it will be very visible in the C2 data feeds. This is the, the uh, SOHO... Uh, MDI continuum image uh, from the SOHO site and if you want to read some more about this um, spot you can go to Space Weather. Uh, Space Weather did a, a little blurb on it. It's a fairly significant spot. This is uh, sort of good news for anyone that's been keeping their eye on the solar cycle and who has been concerned about um, the effects of the extended solar minimum on the weather and the economy and things of that nature. And so this is, I consider this to be a fairly auspicious thing. You know, this is the um, the thing that the Vedas were on about about the, uh, the higher light, uh, the cosmic uh, light. And so it sort of is returning for a while here. I don't know if this is just another false start for cycle 24. Hopefully not. So time will tell.